He will be starting soon. Oh, story time with Mr. Lamada. Where all your dreams come true. Oh, he brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely. Won't you start? All the reading, I just can't wait to be hearing Story time with Mr. Lamada He will be starting soon Oh Story time with Mr. Lamada Where all your dreams come true Oh he brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely, you won't just start all the reading. I just can't wait to be <laughs> Good morning, good morning, and welcome to Storytime. Thank you so much for joining in. I don't think we've been able to do that in a while, but yes, happy to be here and glad indeed uh, for another special day together, another day of reading, another day of getting lost in the books. Thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. Please let us know where you're joining in from and who is joining in with you. And I hope that you are ready for this beautiful, uplifting book that we have here today. And this one is called The Sky is the Limit. And it is written by Ralph Liza and um, Lisa Swirling. And of course, we're reading it with permission of the publishers, Chronicle Books of San Francisco. And this one is called A Celebration of All the Things You Can Do. Yes, indeed. And um, it's November. Today's already November 3rd. So the year is drawing to a close. You know, when you look at where we've come from, January, and now we're, you know, almost at the end of the year. And um, yeah, you know, all the best to everybody that is either taking you know exams right now i know in zambia for sure um uh seniors and uh, i think ninth grade has already gone um seventh grade is already done i think so there's exams that are happening and uh, we wish you the very best and um to two special people to my nieces um chand of faith and of course uh Pearl, I'm wishing you the very best, all the best with your exams as they're happening, as um, you'll be going in. I know you'll be shining right through. And remember, too, don't let those exams define you. We love you no matter what, and you're the best no matter what. Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today, and glad we're here together. So, yeah, this is a book that I've usually... Um, read at the you know around may and so on at the end of um end of the school year but this time too i just thought we should read it as we we're drawing closer to the end of the year and it just felt like one of those books that just um yeah that i think really lends itself to this and it is um a time to reflect on how the year has been so far how is it going for you you know like what are some um what are some uh, targets that you had how are they going and it's okay if you know like you're not there yet because we know that you know we set we set we set targets but it's not all the time that we get to meet them right but for as long as we tried our best to get there I mean, that's all you can do, right? That's all you can do. So wishing you the best with that. But um, also just I uh, think this book is a good reminder to celebrate those little things. Celebrate the little things as much as we celebrate the big things, but also celebrate those step-by-step -step, um, um, victories. So thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Glad we're here together and cannot wait to get into our book today. Lisa Swirling and Ralph Lazar and, of course, Chronicle Books of San Francisco bringing us a wonderful book. Yeah. Yes, um, thank you so much for being here. Let us see this morning who is with us. Yes, ready to enjoy a wonderful story. Thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. How are you doing there today, Megan? And of course, Ari, and you say good morning, sunny and cold out there in Kentucky. Maple has to go to the vet this morning, so we will finish watching the recording. But happy Friday, friends. Well, Maple all the best at the vets and it's just your annual checkup well reminder too for all of us too if you've not set it up yet 
please make sure you, if you're able to, please make sure that you go in and um, um, just just get tested, get looked at, and just so you know, you know, like, um, I know it's not 100% foolproof, but at least we get to know, right? We get to know if there's anything that we need or indeed if we need to uh, change up a few things, make a few adjustments here and there. But um, a good reminder, yes. Maple, thank you for that reminder. Everybody else too, um, remember to, um, don't forget to get your flu shots and everything else that is out there, vaccines. Please, please make sure that you do that so you are staying protected. Thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. A timely reminder from Megan, Ari, and Maple. Thank you so much for being here with us on Storytime. To everybody else that is joining us later on for the recordings, well, thank you for being here. Thank you for tuning in. And please remember to share with friends. Let them know that we're here. Let them come and join in this community and read amazing books with us. Thank you so much for joining us today here on Storytime. The sky is the limit a celebration of all the things you can do written by lisa swirling and ralph lazar and we are reading it with permission of the publishers chronicle books of san francisco a big 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 what's up and thank you to the chronicle books team of course ariel richardson victoria rock uh, melissa manlove and the entire team out there caitlin elk everybody that is there while well, we're sending you love appreciations and thank you thank you for these amazing books that we keep having from you here and a special special guest is coming to story time on monday we do have um we do have uh grant snyder joining us for that one will be here so please join us a um a special one indeed and i cannot wait and we will be reading his brand new book Nothing ever happens on a gray day, or does it? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for joining in Storytime today. Absolutely appreciate you. Tara McNamara, thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. And of course, the amazing Erin, good morning to you. Thank you. And you're joining us from out there in Massachusetts where it is chilly right now. Thank you so much for joining us here. Hopefully you're staying warm. And of course, hope this wonderful book adds to that warmth thank you so much for being here with us erin and of course tara thank you for joining us out there in massachusetts and of course we're sending you love clara as well thank you thank you for being here with us on story time please get ready get comfortable get cozy as we'll be coming right back after this break for more story time thank you so much for joining in friends and always always a pleasure to be here with you <laughs> hi friends my name is Christy, and I am the author of A Heart in the Sand, also known as Un Corazón en la Arena. Now, this bilingual book is about tesoros, or treasures, and something that I treasure is my friendship with Mr. Lumada. So, I have a challenge for you. Share this story time with someone who you treasure, and we can all spread the literary love. Yes, we can share the literally love. Oh, thank you so much, uh, Christy Deprin. And uh, of course, if you've not checked out A Heart in the Sand, please do. And uh, we've had Lisa, uh, we've had, um, I'm saying Lisa Swirling, no, we've had. <laughs> I have to slow down. That's what I have to do. <laughs> We've had Christy Deprin here on Storytime. And please check out that conversation that we had. And of course, amazing, amazing book there. A Heart in the Sand. Like, oh, a Corazon La Arena. <laughs> one day, one day I'll get it right. <laughs> I need to keep practicing. That's what I do. The problem is once it goes, I forget to practice. And then when it comes back around, I'm like, oh, I needed to do that. But one day, one day I'll get it. All right, here we go. <laughs> the sky is the limit. A celebration of all the things you can do. Written and illustrated by Lisa Swirling and Ralph Lazar. And we are reading this one with permission of the publishers, Chronicle Books of San Francisco. And also, if you get a copy of this book, it's actually texture, this texture to these uh, illustrations are on, on the cover here. So it, it, it's a good feeling. I hope you get it and you can try it out too. Here we go. The sky is the limit. A celebration of all the things you can do. Lisa Swirling 
and draw flies, uh, and of course, Chronicle Bucks of San Francisco. Yeah. <laughs> A world full of wonder is waiting for you. Yeah. A world full of wonder is waiting for you. The sky is the limit of what you can do. Mwah. <laughs> Oh, yes, indeed. A world of wonder is waiting for you. The sky is the limit of what you can do. There are roads to be traveled. Yes, a world of wonder is waiting for you. The sky is the limit of what you can do. There are roads to be traveled. There are roads to be traveled. And dreams to unfold. There are roads to be traveled and dreams to unfold. Magic to conjure and tales to be told. Yeah. There are dreams to unfold, magic to conjure, and tales to be told. Yeah. A world of wonder is waiting for you. Sky is the limit of what you can do. <laughs> Cakes to be gobbled. Oh, I want to be a part of that. And spoons to be licked. <laughs> yes. Cakes to be gobbled. Oh, yeah. And spoons to be licked. <laughs> ah, yes, indeed. Cupboards to hide in. Friends to be tricked. <laughs> oh, that definitely sounds like my world. Cupboards to hide in. <laughs> and friends to be tricked. That's what friends are for. <laughs> friends to be tricked. <laughs> oh, feet. To be tickled <laughs> and backs to be scratched. No. <laughs> oh, yes, indeed. Maps to be followed and plans to be hatched. <laughs> yes, feet to be tickled and backs to be scratched. Maps to be followed and plans to be hatched. Yeah. <laughs> A world of wonder is waiting for you. <laughs> Bikes to be ridden and fences to mend. Yeah. <laughs> Bikes to be ridden and fences to mend. Yeah. <laughs> fortunes to squirrel and fortunes to spend. <laughs> oh. Oh, go on, spoil yourself. <laughs> fortunes to squirrel and fortunes to spend. <laughs> oh, delicious. Yum, yum, yum. Trees to be clambered and bubbles to pop. Lakes 
to be dived in and bellies to flop. <laughs> oh. Isn't that sound like fun? Yeah. <laughs> Trees to be clumbered and bubbles to pop. Lakes to be dived in and bellies to flop. <laughs> Costumes to dazzle. Yeah. <laughs> Did you dazzle this 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 uh, Halloween <laughs> in your costumes? <laughs> costumes to dazzle. Oh. <laughs> costumes to dazzle. And parties to throw. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> Costumes to dazzle and parties to throw. Oh. Rainstorms to run in and flowers to grow. Oh. <laughs> Costumes to dazzle. Party, parties to throw, rainstorms to run in, and flowers to grow. Teams to be a part of, and trophies to shine. <laughs> yes, teams to be a part of, to be part of and trophies to shine. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Beans to be planted and beanstalks to climb. <laughs> yes, teams to be a part of, teams to be part of, and trophies to shine. Beans to be planted and beanstalks to climb. <laughs> oh. Knots to untangle and boats to be railed. Oh. Yeah. Oh, to be sailed. I'm sorry. <laughs> Knots to untangle and boats to be sailed. To untangle and boats to be sailed. <laughs> Hills to be rowed down. Oh, yes. Hills to be rowed down. <laughs> Hills to be rowed down. And peaks to be scaled. Yes. Knots to untangle, knots to be untangled, boats to be sailed, <laughs> hills to be rowed down on, and of course, peaks to be scaled. Yeah. <clears throat> Causes to work for, yes, and letters to write, lots of letters to write. <laughs> Causes to work for and letters to write. <laughs> Stars to sleep under, friends to hold tight. Yes, stars to sleep under, friends to hold tight. Stars to sleep under, friends to hold tight. <laughs> Lives to imagine and hands to be held. Oh. <laughs> Lives to imagine and hands to be held. Yeah. <laughs> Poems to whisper. Oh, 
and songs to be yelled. <laughs> Poems to whisper and songs to be yelled. <laughs> Lessons to learn and books to be read. Yeah, each holding a glimpse of what lies ahead. Yeah, lessons to learn and books to read, each holding a glimpse of what lies ahead. <laughs> On land and on land and by air and in dreams that come true with blue skies and sunshine. On land and by air and in dreams that come true with blue skies and sunshine. Well, 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 well. This world awaits you. Aww. <laughs> and that is the end of our story for today yes indeed this world awaits you a world of wonder awaits you out there thank you so much for being here friends i hope you enjoyed that beautiful story i'll catch you on the other side of this very short break <laughs> hello i'm brianna Carzu, the author and illustrator of lou and you're watching story time with mr lamada Welcome back. Thank you, Brianna Kazoo, and of course, author of Lou, and very, uh, and most recently, of course, Greenlight. So check those out at your local library. Check them out at your local bookstore. Thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. Absolutely love it. Yes, the sky is the limit. A celebration of all the things that you can do. Written by Lisa Swirling and Ralph Lazar, and we were reading it with permission of the publishers. Chronicle Books of San Francisco. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for taking the time to join us here on Storytime and enjoy this lovely book with us. I hope you enjoyed it. I most certainly did. And I will tell you this, it's not the last time that we're having this book here on Storytime. It will definitely be back soon. Thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. Absolutely appreciate you, appreciate the creators, and of course, appreciate another day here together. Thank you so much for joining in. And as always, please leave us a message let us know you were here share with your friends let them know story time is here let them come on in and join us and enjoy fun stories with us as well and of course learning together and being in community together thank you for being here absolutely appreciate you i hope that everything that you are up to this week goes well goes um in very much a way that you're hoping for well this weekend and i hope that um indeed this is one that is enjoyable for you thank you so much for being here with us on story time taking the time to be here taking taking the time to read with us, taking the time to learn with us. This has been story time for this week. This has been story time on this lovely, lovely Friday morning. I hope it is indeed lovely for you as well. And um, chilly in places, so be sure to grab that jacket. We know that up in Massachusetts, it is cold today. Yes, yeah, so be ready for that and make sure to have your jackets out, just like I'm sure Erin will be there out there. And of course, Tara, thank you so much for joining us here on story time. And uh, uh, out in Kentucky, thank you for joining us here, Megan and Ari, and I hope that uh, Maple, your um, vet visit goes smoothly. Thank you so much for joining us. And just a reminder too for all of us, remember to set up those uh, doctor's appointments, go in, have yourself checked, have yourself looked at, and just to make sure that, you know, we're okay. And of course, too, you know, just um, uh, it is important to also just uh, keep up to date with all vaccinations and everything else that needs to, to to be updated so please please uh make those appointments and uh, go in for a checkup thank you so much for being here with us on story time today yes a reminder i think this book has, does a good job here reminding us too that you know 
the world is out there. The world is out there. There's, um, it is waiting for us. A world of wonder is out there waiting for us. And I hope for all you little ones that are joining us, you know, I hope you have the opportunity to travel the world. I hope you have the opportunity to just um, see what's out there to be seen and, of course, get to enjoy life that way. And, um, yeah, wishing you all the very best on this journey of life. Thank you so much for joining us here on Storytime. Always a pleasure to be here with you. Don't take it for granted, appreciating every single minute that we have together. And I hope that you can join us again next week for more story time. The next week, we're kicking off the week. Um, we're kicking off the week on Monday with a special guest. Grant Snyder will be here on Storytime. We've read so many of his books and um, yeah, cannot wait to have him here with us on Storytime. So Monday, Grant Snyder will be here. And guess what? Monday is also my birthday. So let's go. A special surprise, a special birthday present there. Grant Snyder coming to us on Storytime. And then on Tuesday, I'll be out and about in Walnut Creek right here in the bay right here. Um, um, going around and um yeah we'll be at barnes and noble and we'll be looking at what books are out and of course to just having some fun with my friend out there nadia Solomon, uh the author and creator of goodnight ganesha so we'll be out there if you're anywhere near the one at creek area join us join us come on out and have fun with us and that's run around at barnes and noble thank you so much for joining in story time today yes there's hands to be held out there, trees to be clumbered, bubbles to pop, lakes to be dived into, and of course, bellies to flop. And I hope that your weekend is just as fun. Thank you so much for being here with us on Storytime. Much love to each and every one of you. And then again, we'll see you well on Monday. That is the plan that we're back here on Monday with another exciting story time. But for now, it is bye-bye. <laughs> see you next week. <laughs> Story time with Mr. Lumada. He will be starting soon. Oh, story time with Mr. Lumada. Where all your dreams come true. Oh, it brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely, won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be here. Story time with Mr. Lamada. He will be starting soon. Oh, story time with Mr. Lamada, where all your dreams come true. Oh, he brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely. Won't you start all the reading? I just can't wait to be here. Starting soon. Story time with Mr. Lumada. Where all your dreams come true. He brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely, won't you start all the reading? We just can't wait to be here. Brings to life your favorite stories with a great big smile. You won't leave lonely, won't you start all the reading? We just can't wait to be here.